Hi there. Um, yeah. I don't know. Ooh, that's not a good look. I'm gonna go buy a canvas right now and some oil paints because it's about time that I hop to this video. Here we go. Hi there. Welcome back. If you couldn't tell, we are doing something along the lines of, I don't know, <laughs> Bob Ross. The long-awaited painting thing that everyone wants me to do is here. That smells so gross. I don't know how to me I don't know what I'm doing. I have oil paints. Um, I don't know how legit they are. I got them at the dollar store, but I think it should be fine. They look legit. And now I still have to mix this, but I'm scared. I don't know how much I need. Um, but I guess I'll pour this into there. Yeah. So we're just gonna... I don't know how far this is gonna go. Okay, so I filled it like halfway-ish. I'm shaking. I don't want this to spill out onto the table. You know what? I probably should have put like newspapers down or something. I don't want to disrespect Bob. I want to do him justice. I have never done this before in my life. What do I need? I don't even know what tutorial I'm doing. Okay, I think I can do this one. Hello, I'm Bob Ross, and I'd like to welcome you to Series 31 of The Joy of Painting. If this is your first time with us, allow me to extend a personal invitation to drag out your paints and brushes. There we are. We'll take a little touch of play with you. Wait, Bob, slow down. I'm not ready. Wait. Okay, I'm going to get some paper plates. I don't have the slightest clue of what I'm doing. Oh, no. What? Watch the cat. Watch the cat. Yeah, he's gotten out twice. I've got my white base. Don't touch it. Oh my god, we're, we're doing this. Bristles, we don't need a lot. Chop a little bit of bristles, we don't need a lot. And we'll start just making... This does not look like yours, Bob. I feel like this is wrong. A little excess. That easy. And we work <gasps> all the way across the canvas. Are we going all the way? Start to tighter and lighter as you work down toward the horizon. Whoa, whoa. Don't know what that means. Shut up, birds. Oh, God. My fear is that I'm gonna do this wrong and it's gonna be like disrespecting him. Now he's taking more. Ow. And he's. I'm sorry, Bob. I don't know what I'm doing. Put this paint thinner. Shake it off. <laughs> and just beat the devil out of it. What? What? Wait. What? Okay, I'm like finally starting to get the right color. He does this thing where he says, get a little roll of it. And get a little roll that lives right out of the edge of the knife. Okay, okay, so you're right here-ish? Never in my life done anything like this. And he goes. Watch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Wait, come right up here. So we're like. Let's go right up here. Don't be afraid of it because it's dark. We're going to put a little highlight. Intimidated. I just wanted to, this to like appear good enough so that like when we have family over and they go, oh, that's a nice painting. My mom can go, my daughter painted that. That was kind of cool though. I can't think I should enjoy it. His looks a lot like mystier and like... There. I think I've gotten somewhere. It's fun to take and reflect a mountain right into the water. Now we're just looking for a basic little reflection here. We're not too worried about it being exact. When you first start, it's easier to take the canvas off your easel and turn it upside down and just basically repaint the mountain. If that works for you, that's 
it's okay. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. 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 So you keep drawing up pretty high. Is close to Sounds like something wheezing. Make just a touch of gray. See, I think I'm starting to figure it out. I'm just not good at it yet. Just let it float right across there. She just want to give some indications. Like, no. Hard. You see it? Wow, that's beautiful. But look at what I'm what, I, what I'm trying to do. That is awesome, man. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, that's so cool. Yeah, that's so cool. Yeah, that's so cool. Yeah, Okay, so basically every camera battery I have died for my main camera, and I'm basically um, giving up. Only because I've been doing this for, I don't know, like three or four hours now, and I have to clean all the brushes, I still have to clean everything up and let this dry, and I'm kind of happy with how it turned out. Um, definitely could have been better, I think, but I feel like far away, and if you squint, it looks okay. It's definitely kind of rough. But I think for a first time painting with um, oil paints on a canvas, it looks okay. I look like a smurf. I don't know how to clean this up. I have no idea what to do. And it's like everywhere. But it didn't get on my clothes, I don't think. See, like from far away, it looks pretty good. So we're just going to leave it here. He adds like a bunch of like rocks and stuff. And I just can't. So maybe like, I don't know, in a while I'll try to revisit this. But I think for now, this is where I have to quit. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more. I would greatly appreciate it if you did. I'm really tired. I've literally been painting, I think, for four hours. Uh, I love you. I will see you guys in my next video. Uh, bye bye. Oh boy, it's windy. I got <coughs> everything I need. Now we're gonna go home. And we're gonna film this video. In we go. You know, it would have been funny as if I buckled it up, but I'm not going to get out of my car and do that because that's a lot of effort that I don't want to put into that. Now I'm going to go home. Whee! Bye!